Hi guys and welcome to the intro of my adjustable base video. Now the reason why I did this video and why I'm trying so many adjustable bases is super obvious and I'm going to tell you why, I'm going to show you why and how I was able to discover something really cool called adjustable beds. And the magical button, the very important button. Um, I'm going to let you in on the secret later on. Now I've tried so many things. I'm married to someone who used to snore like really loud. Sometimes it's scary. I think that I'm dreaming about dinosaurs sometimes. That's how loud it used to be. <laughs> and that would wake me up and I'm like, and he wouldn't wake up at all. So I tried so many things, so many different things. I can't even tell you, but I'm going to show you what I did to him. I cannot show you at nighttime because first of all, he's sleeping. Second, because it's gonna be super dark so you won't be able to see um, with your own eyes. So I'm going to call him in and show you exactly what I've tried to do to keep him from snoring or to wake him up or to shut him up, seriously. So sometimes I'm just wearing my mask and I seriously tried this. Oh my gosh, she's so loud. I would put it around his mouth. Cover your mouth. That would make him up, by the way, guys. He's so loud. Hmm. Technique number two. You can't try this at home, trust me. Won't hurt. But don't try it with a purple pillow pillow. Because <laughs> it's so loud it might kill someone. Just stop snoring. Seriously, I've tried this as well. Now, when these two techniques did not work, here's what I tried. I know you might call me a mean person, but I tried to push him off the bed. Are you serious? But then I discovered the magic of adjustable bases and this magical button here called anti snore. Seriously, ever since, it could be the adjustable base, it could be the anti-snore button, but once I hit this button, it was our very first time trying an adjustable base, it was the Rise Verge, he stopped snoring. So instead of having a box spring, or just a normal frame, now you can have an adjustable base. Now I'm going to tell you all about the magic that's inside these adjustable bases. Now what I have in my room right here, it's just some adjustable bases that I was able to keep. Uh, I couldn't keep uh, maybe about three or four other adjustable bases because seriously, I mean, this house is not big enough. If it was big enough, I would gladly show you all the bases that I have tested and put together and assembled all by myself. So here I am going to tell you about these adjustable bases, what I have, and I will talk more about the ones that I don't have anymore, but I have tested and tried just so you guys know what you need to purchase, what you're looking for when you're buying an adjustable base. Not every adjustable base is like the other. So let's introduce you to our adjustable bases here in this room. In this corner is the classic brand's adjustable base. This one is sold by Dream Cloud and Nectar. And I have tried them both. I have over there the Lisa adjustable base made by Legget and Platt, sold by Lisa. Right here I have the Rise adjustable base made in the USA. And then I have the Tomorrow Sleep Adjustable Base made by Customatic. Let's talk about each and every adjustable base and their features. Not the very best. You can tell from the beginning that it's a little thinner than the others. Um, now, it may do the job that this is exactly what you want. This is the adjustable base that you would like to purchase. It has all these features on the remote control. Um, the light, it's like a sensor light. It just comes off randomly, but it's because of the things that move around it. But I'm still trying to figure it out. It does not have a massager. It does not have a under bed light but it has a light that comes out <laughs> randomly, just like now. 
but it does have the head that goes up and down, the foot, and zero gravity, TV, flat. Now I'm telling you right now that we will eliminate the tomorrow sleep from this group because we've tested so many mattresses on this tomorrow sleep adjustable base and every time you try to lift the foot part, what happens is that the mattress itself sticks out. So even the purple mattress, and I know I thought the purple mattress should be moving better than other foam mattresses or hybrid mattresses and I put it on the tomorrow sleep and yet it was just sticking out on the foot part when I was raising the foot. So that's why we have to eliminate the tomorrow sleep. Right now I'm sitting on the rise adjustable base. Here's a cool feature that you cannot find in any other adjustable base. The foot right here, it goes down. Look how low it goes while all the other adjustable bases, when you put them on flat or uh, raise the foot, let's say they just stop at some point. This one goes all the way down just like that. So let's talk more about its features. Here I have the remote control. I do have the light and it's so cool. When you hit the light, you're able to see all the buttons as well. And then you have the head, of course, foot, flat, massager, and lounge, zero gravity, and anti-snore. And believe me, anti-snore helps a lot. It saves your relationship, trust me. <laughs> Just a reminder, Rise has so many adjustable bases. This one is the Verge. You can find all these specifics and its lifting capacity on my blog. Now you're thinking, okay, now I move to the rise adjustable base, which means I have to eliminate it because something is not that awesome about it. Wrong. I'm keeping this one. This is also one of the best adjustable bases that I have tried so far. But let's move to the next one. So, I am on the new adjustable base. You can hear that sound. <laughs> this, listen. Don't freak out or anything when you move the foot or the head. This is just the motors, and that's how loud they are. I mean, that is one thing I wasn't really a big fan of. Now, for security reason maybe, or to secure your mattress on the adjustable base, they probably figured out maybe some type of Velcro would be nice. Um, well, it is nice when you put the mattress on the adjustable ba base. Not so fun when you have to take that mattress off the adjustable base because it takes forever, seriously. Even, uh, especially when you're by yourself doing it. So, that is not the issue here. What I have noticed also is that the Lisa adjustable base is not as thick, if you want, as the other adjustable bases I have tried. And that's why we're making this video, to show you the differences and the, the things that these adjustable bases have in common as well. Now, I do have this remote control in my hand, and it's simple and basic. Head, foot, or simultaneously, you can move them. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna push this button. Okay, this one. <laughs> and it's simultaneously moving the head and the foot together, which creates one of the positions that you can find in other adjustable bases. It could be a lounge, it could be TV, it's it could be a rest or anti-snore, especially with the head alone. That's very good. The Lisa adjustable base does not have a massager and it also does not have USB ports. No big deal probably for, for some people. It did very well with the Lisa uh, mattress on it and it moved really cool. But it's not as sturdy, if you want, as the other adjustable bases I have tried. Nisa, we love you and everything you guys do to the community, which is really important. 
but I am here to tell all about, you know, from the heart of Nuan or the honesty and that's why I sleep test and I try them and I sleep on them and I'm physically on it just to tell people on what to purchase and what not. If you're looking for something basic and you no, know, like I said, no um, USBs, no massagers, it does have an uh, under light, under red light, but that's pretty much it. Um, but it's going to be eliminated. Before we make this lease, I just will base disappear. Let's just have fun and lift both feet of the Lisa and the rise at the same time just to show you the difference between them well, there you go, it goes a little higher you still can hear it's like someone drilling I'm gonna go though just you can barely hear the rise I'm gonna go foot down and you can hear that obviously so unless you have hearing problems then you're fine <laughs> all right Lisa we're gonna say bye bye to you and go to the next best adjustable base right here also I have one of the best adjustable bases I have tried this is the dream cloud adjustable base coming from classic brands just like the nectar adjustable base as well now, I have put the Dream Cloud mattress. It's a 15 inch mattress. It's really thick and it's really heavy and it was able to move just perfectly on its own adjustable base. I've also tried the Dream Cloud mattress on each and every other adjustable base I have tried and it didn't quite move as well as it did on its own adjustable base except for the rise and that's why i'm going to put them head to head side by side and i'm a little torn and i will tell you why i cannot make a decision but these two can be uh my you know best adjustable bases uh, but let's talk a little bit about this adjustable base and why i really love it first of all it came in two pieces and I was able to assemble it easily. Um, the book itself was super easy to follow or the manual. It was labeled and so cool that you can follow colors and labels. Now, also I have ordered the Nectar adjustable base, but I was in an apartment, so I had stairs and I was able to carry these two parts upstairs just to show you how easy it is or is it going to be easy to have a one level and one story house or an apartment and you can move that adjustable base in both cases it was super easy super easy to assemble follow the instructions labels colors everything in this adjustable base you will find almost everything everything except for the foot that doesn't go as low as the rise adjustable base probably seriously what you see here is what you get let's start with this cool thing that's the light right here and then we have all the other features so many features tv anti-snore zero gravity head and foot up and down or simultaneously just like now it's so cool and so many other features that you get to discover. Now, why do I like the drink adjustable base and why do I like also the rise adjustable base? Um, now, the drink adjustable base is affordable and its lifting capacity is amazing. The rise does have only one massager, one massager fits all, but this one has many massagers not just one and that explains probably why i'm torn between the rise and the dream cloud now if i had to choose myself personally i would go with the dream cloud first and then the rise would be my second pick because it's more affordable with all the things that come with it i do not own the purple adjustable base 
but I do have the purple mattress and the purple mattress did awesome in each and every adjustable base. Now the reason why I do not have the purple adjustable base is because I do purchase purple products to test. The purple adjustable base happens to be double the price of this adjustable base that I'm sitting on. So if you're looking for an adjustable base, I have put together this video for you guys to choose. You don't have to go with the highest price point if you want. You can go with an affordable adjustable base and be super happy with it. Which leaves us with the Dream Cloud and Nectar Adjustable Base and the Rise Verge Base in the same room. Let me just compare these two or show you with your own eyes. So I'm trying to push the foot button on the Dream Cloud and the foot button on the Rise and here's what happens. You see that? The Rise goes low and it's really cool. Now, why or what do I need to purchase? Which one do I need to make up my mind on if you want? Now what I have here is the Classic Brands Adjustable Base and I have found out that um, it's sold with two different companies uh, but the price was not the same although they have the exact same feature and it's the exact same bag and I sent them an email thinking, hey, you guys, what's going on? Why is this bat $100 more than the other bat? And they were able to lower the price and I was super happy. Now you have the same bat, classic brands, with the same price that you can purchase from two different companies, whichever company you are comfortable with. So this is how I was able to get you the best deal out there. The best deal with the best Features. This is the Dream Cloud Adjustable Base. Now the Rise Adjustable Base is over a thousand dollars. This is how much it costs. While the Dream Cloud or Classic Brands is about seven hundred and fifty dollars only with all the features that come with it. Um, the only difference is that they have just one massager, while this one has two massagers head and foot. This one, um, I mean, it only goes, the foot goes lower than the other, and that's pretty much it, I guess. And I'm hitting the wrong one. <laughs> but then this one, when this one goes flat, this is it. It goes flat and that's it. When go back to flat on the right adjustable base, it readjusts itself, which is really cool. Now in case you're wondering which one I should buy, I say go with the classic brands because of the price point. With this one you need to find the legs and screw them in. And they all are heavy just so you know, so always ask for help. The classic brands come in, comes in two pieces, so you have to assemble it, find the accessories, put them together, but everything is labeled. Um, and you can also carry it up the stairs with two different pieces. It's super easy. We've tried the one-story and then two-story house, and it was super easy to assemble and adjust. And that is our movie for the best adjustable bases or the battle of the adjustable bases. There's so many other adjustable bases that I haven't tried yet. I know I have another adjustable base coming also from Legged and Plaid. And we will find out if it is the same as the Legged and Plaid I have from the Lisa adjustable base. So I will keep you posted. Um, to find out more about all the prices, the good deals, the promos, the discounts, um, the lifting capacities, that's really important. Um, everything is in one blog. Uh, please go to our website to find out more and leave any questions, likes or even dislikes. Um, and let me know if you have any concerns, we are here to answer them. Thanks for watching.